It is 624. We are checking in once again with meteorologist Sam Sampiri. So, Sam, the Super Bowl already off to an exciting start for you because you're tracking this storm. One of these flakes going to start falling here in Connecticut. Uh, it's going to start in a couple of hours, say between uh, 8 and 9 o'clock. So we have Super Snow Sunday. We've been talking about this for the last couple of days. It's going to be cold and stormy and cold, too, this week with possible snow on Tuesday and uh, Friday. Here, I'll get over on the other side and stand by the football here. Here's the timing, basically 7 a.m. to 6. Now, could take a little bit of time here to get going at 8. Noon to 5, uh, 10, 11 o'clock to 5 o'clock, it's the worst. And then uh, it's a quick hitter. Winds could gust 20 to 30, but I'm not really too worried about the winds. Heaviest snow in southwestern uh, Connecticut. And as a result, winter storm warning, southern Connecticut, uh, National Weather Service has decided to uh, take away the warning and reduce it down to winter weather advisories, knowing that the trend of the storm is going to go far enough south not to give us the heaviest banding, although you never trust a snow event. So these are our current indications, what we're thinking, five to eight inches southeastern Connecticut, where it's warned area, even down into the southern areas of New Haven County, uh, three to six, maybe seven or eight down in here, depending on how far north the banding gets. And that's the whole key to these systems, three to six for most of us here, and then two to three in far Litchfield County, the area that usually gets the most uh, snow. Temperatures across the area are cold enough. That certainly uh, is good news. We don't have to deal with any rain, mix, or ice. And the wind is basically out of the north and northeast. So we're starting to see uh, that storm develop off to our south. Where is that storm? Well, that storm is off the Carolina coast right now. All this moisture now beginning to slowly move up. Now it's taking a while for the snow to uh, get cranking here in the New Jer northern New Jersey. I just looked at observation, New York City. Not much uh, going on yet, but as we zoom in here, uh, it looks like it's trying to snow. Well, it's trying to snow in the upper levels of the atmosphere. The atmosphere needs to saturate. We need to moisten up the atmosphere before you can get it uh, to snow because we have very dry, cold air mass in place. And local live Doppler showing we don't see the snow uh, going on. Again, out to the west here, it's starting to snow a lot, but it's going to take a while. Again, a couple of more hours, and we'll start to see that snow come down. We'll get that quick hitter. So let's time it all out for you. So you see by 9, 9.30, so 8 to 9 o'clock, we'll get some snow developing across the region in southern areas. By 10, 10.30, it's starting to overspread. By noontime, here it goes. It's, we see all blues. And there you go, uh, bands of moderate snow. Now the question is, how far north and west do any of these bands go, okay? You get a heavy band in, in one area, you can get a quick a uh, couple of inches per hour, one to two inches. But right now we're thinking it's confined to southeastern C Connecticut. One computer model insists on bringing heavier snow as far north as the Hartford area. It's something that I'll be watching all day long. But again, this is a quick hitter. T you know, by four or five o'clock, it's out of here. And that's really uh, about it. Again, three to six inches in the Hartford area higher amounts southeastern Connecticut. And if that's not enough, take a look at Tuesday. Uh, morning we could have some issues. We could mix in with a little bit of rain as some warmer air tries to work north Tuesday afternoon. Could get a couple of more inches out of that one. I'm not too concerned uh, with that storm. And then we're going to have to watch a couple of more storms move on by and just rolling on by. And here's that bigger one coming in on Friday. <laughs> I'm laughing because I didn't put any pause points uh, that this, the, the European model is just cranking away. Uh, point is, as your Fox 61 seven-day forecast showing you, uh, that again, that wintry mix for Tuesday and then again on uh, Friday. That's a bigger storm, I think, on Friday into Saturday. But again, today's storm, a quick hitter, the heaviest between 11 and about 3 o'clock. And we'll pick up a good uh, 3 to 6 inches higher amount southeastern Connecticut, uh, maybe only 2 or 3 in northwestern Connecticut. Angelo?